I'm John Cooper from MPC and I'm happy to be showing you the steps involved in operating our PAL 1000 gold assay system. First step is we go to our HMI panel, press the jog button, which moves the bottle arms around into the correct position for loading and unloading. We then use the tilt button to jog or move the arms in the, to the vertical position. Then remove the locking pins to open the arm to allow access to the pots. We then place one of the pins in the end to stop the arm falling down. The lids are then removed and placed into the trough on the front. We add one litre of water from our mains programmable water dispenser into each of the pots prior to adding our samples. Next, we add our sample into each of the pots. This is typically um, blast hole drill samples or RC drill chips, they're perfectly adequate. Sample mass up to one kilogram. Finally, two assay tabs into each pot. Uh, we replace the lids onto each of the, the pots. Remove the safety pin. Close the, the arms. Reinsert the safety pin. After we've closed this arm, we move to the screen. Press the jog button. And that will move the arms around to the next position for loading and unloading. After loading all four arms, we close the top door move to the HMI panel and press the run button to start its programmed run time. Right, so the machine has finished its run. We'll now open the door. Open the arms by first removing the locking pin. Open the clamping bar. Place the pin in the arm to stop it falling down on the operator. It's easier at this stage if we remove the arm. Remove the lids like we did previously. We then move the trough, the bottom door in. We then take a sample from each of the pots. And place them in the rack ready for the centrifuge. Uh, now we rotate the pots to empty the contents out so that we can clean the pots in the grinding media by pressing the tilt down button. So now that the pots are emptied, we use a hose to wash the pots and the grinding media to remove traces of the previous samples. Uh, grinding media, baskets, Of course, the next step now is to rotate the pots vertically again to replace the grinding media 
and to get ready for the next samples. So pull the trough out. The grinding media now replaced in all of the pots. ready for the next samples. That concludes our tutorial for today. Thank you for watching. If you need any more information, please don't hesitate to contact us via our website.